And we could see more superstorms like Sandy, along with massive wildfires, epic flooding, and drought. A new report says they could be worse than anything we've faced in 500 years. The World Meteorological Association says the last decade was the warmest ever. We saw new heat records on land and at sea. Plus, it was the wettest period in a century with more floods and hurricanes. Professor Michio Kaku is a physicist at the City University of New York and a CBS This Morning contributor. Professor, good morning. Morning. How significant is this report? This report is devastating. You know, you don't need a weatherman to know that something is terribly wrong with the weather. Right. <laughs> Everywhere I go, people say the weather's out of control. 100-year flooding, 100-year heat waves, especially in Europe, 100-year storms. And this report summarizes it all. The last decade has gone down as the hottest decade ever recorded in the history of science. You have to go back to 1850. In fact, I was just in Germany last month lecturing there. Flooding in Germany is so bad you have to go back 500 years, back to the Middle Ages, to find anything comparable to this. So this report from the United Nations is a wake-up call. Yes, one scientist told us it's not just global warming, it's almost like global weirding. All <laughs> the weather is more extreme. Yeah. Right. We're talking about global swings. It's not like a uniform rising of the temperature of the planet Earth. It swings, which means that there's more moisture in the air. More moisture and more energy means you can have flooding in one area, like the Mississippi, and then forest fires and droughts in the southwest. And so we have swings right in the same country. And that's what we're seeing. All the indicators point up. Hottest decade ever recorded, massive flooding, hurricanes, heat waves, you name it. You can see it in this report summarizing the last decade. So, Professor, is this, I mean, some people have supposed that this are, these are natural cycles we're going through, or is this just greenhouse gases causing all this? Well, I used to think it was just natural cycles. The Earth has been heating up for the last 10,000 years, and I used to be a skeptic. Mm -hmm. I used to say the Earth is so big, we're so small. Give me a break. It's just a natural cycle. But you see, all the the indicators point up and we have this spike in the last 100 years we've seen a spiking in terms of temperatures that is not consistent with the gradual warming since the end of the last ice age and that's ominous the fact that just in the last few decades we've broken record after record all right professor Michio Kaku thanks so much